All right, welcome to episode three of Five Minute Music News. Um, I don't know if it's gonna be five minutes or not, but we'll see. Um, so first little bit of business: the Jonas Brothers released a new single in a new video. It is called Cool. I love the video. It is funny. It's amazing. It it's really funny. Um, and all the little innuendos that they put in the song, like. Game of Thrones, Red Dress, um, oh, there's a couple others, what was the other one, um, crap, Post Malone, because he mentioned them in one of their songs, they mentioned them in one of theirs, um, there's a few others that aren't coming to my head right now, um, but that was really cool, um, I literally, like, fangirled all day on Friday when it came out. Like, legit, just fangirled all day. <laughs> because I also went to a Tony Mac concert, which was also a lot of fun. So, yeah, that was crazy. Alright, um, the last little bit of Christian music news I have for you guys today. Well, actually, let's go ahead and say this. Danny Goki has a new album coming out on Friday, and I am super excited about it. I love all the songs that that he's currently released from it. Um, I was finally able to add a couple of them to the radio station, at least the ones I wanted, um, which I am so happy that I got to add those in there. Um, but I can't wait for this album. I pre-ordered it, and it should be getting to me very shortly, hopefully this sometime this week. Um, yes, yeah, so there's that. Um, and then Jeremy Camp posted um he was at the concert on friday with toby mac and everybody else and he i loved seeing him again and um that was really fun um but oh he has a movie coming out which i've mentioned before um i still believe it's about his story and what he went through when his first wife died of cancer very shortly after they got married um and it's I am really looking forward to this movie, but he just really, he just told us, um, I think it might have been yesterday, or the day before, yeah, yesterday, Saturday, um, he just announced who was playing him and his dad, um, KJ, I think it's Appa, Appa, um, from Riverdale is playing Jeremy Camp, and Gary Sinis, I think that's how you pronounce his last name, Sinis is playing his dad, now, I have been I have been watching Gary Sinus for as long as I can remember from CSN New York to um, the Colonel Minds Beyond Borders. I love him. He's an amazing actor. He does a lot of work with veterans and um, the military, and I love everything that he's been doing. And I love I just love him as a person. Um, he's one of the ones I really want to meet one day and be like, "You're amazing. You're cool." Um, yeah, um, and then you've got, um, KJ Appa, 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 whatever, um, he is on Riverdale, um, me and my roommate were a little surprised that he's playing Jammy Camp, um, just because of other things he's played in, they don't s sort of cor correline, correlate, um, but I mean, I'm really looking forward to this movie, Whoever plays who, I don't care. Um, I'm just really looking forward to this movie. Um, comes out next March, March 20th. Um, so, I'm definitely going to be seeing that movie. So, it's made by the same people who made I Can Only Imagine. And so, I am super stoked. So, but, that's all the music, that's all the news I got for you guys today. Um, I will talk to you guys in a bit.